That ship is really great because it really is like a family. Like you do get to know everyone and you know, you're never alone. There's always somebody that can help you and there's always professors there and people you can meet in any organization. Well, there's Greek life, there's sports organizations, there's science clubs, math clubs, psychology clubs, there's clubs for anything you could possibly want. But then also there's like the honor student organization is the group of us that plan events, do community service, things like that. And so, yeah, I'm serving as the treasurer, so, you know, I help plan all the events and manage the money and everything like that. Well, last year we hosted a charity ball and raised like $2,000, I think, or something for girls in Africa to go to school. And so we sent like, I think like 50 girls to school. So it's pretty cool. I did some research at Texas A&M this past summer, and it's a pretty competitive program through the National Science Foundation. And so I was able to get into it thanks partially to the professors here at SHIP for, you know, telling me about the program, writing letters of recommendation, and it's kind of an experience for kids who might go to a smaller school who want to experience what research can be like at a big institution. I worked um, on a computational chemistry project, which means I wasn't actually using chemicals, I was doing everything theoretically on a computer. I was trying to find a way to make a model on a computer, that way it saves time so you don't have to do actual chemistry in a lab, and it's kind of like, it's so you can kind of predict what would happen in a lab, so you don't have to like because lab work is really time consuming and computers can do things really quickly. I hope to go to graduate school, which this department really does prepare you well for, so hopefully I'll be able to do that. And then after I'm done graduate school, I just hope to be able to do research like in a lab as a chemist somewhere.